Hey everybody, and today this is going to be my review on the Rubik's UFO. And this is a puzzle that has been discontinued by Rubik's for some while, and there hasn't really been any knockoffs of it. There's been some uh, kind of things that you solve the same, like the little star puzzles, or even a cheese type cube. But there hasn't been any UFOs, and now you can buy them on eBay, and there'll be a link in the description to the search. And I got my puzzle at a specialty toy store. They just happen to have one left. They have had them for a while, I guess. And mostly what they sell is dice. And they had a few Rubik's Cubes there. And one of them was the UFO. I got it for about $11. So it's one I really wanted the rotation on this puzzle. It flips on every line. See there? It has a green side and a black or gray side. And it also spins like this. Well, uh, the solving on this puzzle is pretty easy, but the turning on it, I did lubricate it with Vaseline because I figured out how to take it apart the first day, and yeah, so I that helped it, and it was kind of stiff at first, but yeah, it's an interesting puzzle, it's a great collector's item, uh, not too many people have these that I've seen. And if you want one, check eBay out. I believe there's one up for bid right now. It's about $5. So, yeah, I'll show you the mechanism of this. This one is attached to this piece. And basically, when the core is all together, it looks like this. And you can see they can slide around there and flip like that. Yeah, and it comes with this nice little stand. Some of them do. And you can also get them on lighttake.com, a link in the description to that as well, I believe they're about $11 there, so not terribly too expensive. But yeah, it's a nice puzzle, I would recommend it to a collector or someone just getting started in the Cuban and wanting an easy, cool item to solve. So, yeah, uh, final verdict, neat puzzle. Would I buy again? Most definitely. So, yeah, uh, thank you for watching. Bye.